Right, today, Monday the 1st of May, I am at Cambrian Heritage Railway in Oswald Street. You can now get a train out of Oswald Street. I thought, why not? I've got nothing better to do. <laughs> Here we are, on the street station, pity about the scaffolding, but hey, Rome wasn't built in a day, these things cost money, can't be cheap refurbishing a station on a railway line. The more of you that ride it, the more money they'll have. So here we are, I'm on the platform, Got two Pacer trains here, these were in Gaboin not so long ago. And you are eventually going to go to Gaboin down that way. That's the plan. Stopping at Gaboin Hospital, or Orthopedic Hospital as well. That is the plan. Good news is, it's steam hauled today. Yay! I'm going on a steam train. And I can see a steam train. I'm not quite forward to this. I haven't been on a train in a while. I hear chuffing. Aha! I've timed that about right. Look, here comes the train. What locomotive have we got? Got to be a bit careful of my battery. I want to film all the way down. I do have to be a bit careful of the battery. I've only got half a battery. And I haven't got my spare battery with me. But just in case you don't believe I'm in Oswald Street, there we go, Oswald Street. You can park your car there, two pounds to park your car, and that's all day. That's not bad, is it? Let's have a nosy at the train. Unfortunately, this is a GoPro, so there is no zoom. But there. I assume that is the steam will be going on. Oh, there's a diesel as well. There is a diesel train as well. Things are moving. Things are moving. I didn't know they had a diesel that big. That's a big diesel train. That is a big diesel. That is a big diesel. Let's let's uh, let's get a good bit of trouble. I don't know where it's going to stop. Is he coming in here? We shall watch him come in. Yes. with two carriages. I don't know if we're going by steam or diesel now. <laughs> I said it was steam. I don't know. Right, on a save battery. steam engine then. You can smell them, there's a smell to them in it. Hot oil. Oh, 
we're doing is just a 10 minute ride it's only it's only 10 minutes I'm just hoping I don't use up all my camera footage 40 percent battery I've got left I don't want to use it much more <laughs> We're about to leave. It's well, well, it's 11 o'clock. Doing very soon. Doing the final checks of the doors, I think. And we'll be on our way. Yeah. There we go. Mac on 11, the book's time. I'm just thinking I've left. I've left all this in a tractor, on a motorbike, in a car, in a bus, in a lorry. I've never left all this in a train before though. as well. This is very exciting. by Sainsbury's at the back of Sainsbury's now if you know the street and we just went to this bridge and we couldn't get underneath the bridge so I've never been any further than this this is now all new to me Though this is mostly empty, there's hardly anybody on this train, which is a little bit sad. If we have to see a bit fuller, make them a bit more money, and uh, we'll get that line to go Boeing train station. Then they only get the money by if people use it.
our due arrival is five past, sorry, ten past eleven. Now five past eleven, so we're actually halfway there. I'm gonna sit the head in a bit, so this looks a bit tight. Got to turn the head off. Out of this with no head. Bit of common sense. I'm seeing a little bit of Oswald Street that I've never seen before, and I've lived here 25 years. industrial state now which is on our left I'll show that on the way back where I work rather than swapping sides all the time I'll do one way down and I'll do the other side on the way back I don't run out of film or battery. This tends to happen to me a lot. I love that smell. I love that steam engine smell. Oh yeah. slowing down. I think we're nearly there.
here. Smack on 10 past as well. Good be back, isn't it? I've made it one way. It's like a fair old thing that does, doesn't it, eh? Play on that. I haven't left those just feeling of them yet. Have arrived. There we go. We're here. Right, we can cross to the end. Shall we make it back? There's a nice little train there, though. We are recording the other side on the way back and we're off and I work just over there my lorry is parked just over there Penton's Foolage I work and we're right by Maysby Road Industrial Estate a bit closer to the steam engine now we've got better noises Anybody knows I'll just free. We've got the tip. <laughs> McDonald's Land Rover. And the lights of just over there.
I love, I used to drive, I learned to drive on a dumper truck just like that. Quite learned to drive it. <laughs> I don't want to sell it. Love another dumper truck. Bigger there. Oh, I'm going on the sheath. Moved in a while.
go ladies and gentlemen if you ever want something to do in Oliver Street on a uh, bank holiday Monday or weekend visit the Cambrian Railway website for train times and availabilities well, if you come out of the train station and turn left it's a really nice footpath that runs along next to the railway line and you can get some really nice footage if you want to do a bit of filming and you don't want to be on the platform head towards Oswald Street Town Centre past the goods depot and we're going to go round behind the back of Sainsbury's it's a really nice little footpath so it's all legal no trespassing and we can get a good shot off some of the trains on the move from the outside I should point out that it took me two weeks because I did the train ride last weekend and then I ran out of battery so I had to stop so I've had to come back the next weekend to do the external shots hence why the weather's a little bit different you might notice a slight contingency of the weather it was sunny when I went on the train it's now a little bit overcast Blackgate 
Main Street and we head down towards Sainsbury's. Crossed over the road there so you can make sure you can get the street names in. Once we're at Sainsbury's we turn left towards the uh, Goods Inn area bit. Sainsbury's. out by the signal box, also street signal box and the engine sheds and we cross over a level crossing, a pedestrianised level crossing and we're on the footpath. Sainsbury's, nice area for some pictures, eh? I better film in.
interesting fact around here as well, I'm just behind Sainsbury's. And if we look over the far side there, there's like another platform. It's not a platform, that's an area where they used to unload cattle during the uh, railway years before the beaching axe fell. Um, Oswald Street is a market town, and that's where they used to unload all the live livestock, apparently. Right. The other end of the footpath brings you out by the highwayman, which is just over there, Maysby Road Industrial Estate. And just over here we have Little, a BP garage and the Arriva garage. Although the Arriva garage is soon to go, which is a pity. We are closing the Arriva bus depot. Also by the uh, church cemetery, which we passed on life as well. There we go. Enterprise! If you can find Enterprise, that's where the path is. Before I was driving the lorries, I drove a bus for Riva. That's my old bus depot. And as I said before, it is soon to be closing. Which is a real shame. I'm moving the whole lot to the Shrewsbury depot instead. Right next to Halfords and B&M and all the rest of it. Now we're on the Gaboin side of the station. And you can see the line here. Better not, we'll go to Gaboin. I should check it out here. over. But hopefully we'll be able to uh, go to Gaboin, which is the main line. Which I shall talk about a bit more in a bit. And we also have, which is now converted to commercial and retail premises, these used to be old engine sheds. I can hear the steam engine moving about now. There's now an antique centre and a few other things down here. is just to our right. There is the engine sheds. And this road, it's the Gaboin Road, runs along level with the railway line. Gaboin is, is a main line station as well, so if you have to go along the main line, you'll be able to get to Oswald Street. If they can uh, get a timetable, and there's the railway bridge there, if they can get a timetable together that matches the main line trains, they give it a real purpose then, because you can get into Oswald Street by train. And with it stopping by the Orthopaedic Hospital, it won't just be a tourist attraction, and then that'll make it a lot busier. Train line is just the other side of that edge. Can't really see it that well. There is a lay by just along here. I am conscious, I am driving. Apologise for the funny noises. Somebody broke into my car last week. 
and uh, they made a mess of my window so while you might be hearing a few funny noises a bit of a flappy noise anyway the railway line is just the other side of that fence that's switching off here's the review Can we see the railway line? Now this is part of the Cambrian Railway Orchard posture. This site is private property and is under careful surveillance. If you wish to visit the orchards or volunteers, please text. So you can't actually go in there, I'm not going to go in there, but the railway line is just over the other side of there. We're not going to be trespassing. Unfortunately, there are two hedges, this is the hedge. Where will I just do beside the other hedge? Da -da -da -da. Nice. <clears throat> Seatbelts on, everything's binging at me. Modern cars, eh? Right. So we are following the line, even though we can't see it, it is just over there. And then we come to the A5, it crosses over the A5 and a level crossing. Just see the railway line over there. There it is, it's all right now. So there's nothing behind us. We'll slow down a bit. There you go, you can see it just there. Look. just over there somewhere so you'll be able to get off for the orthopedic which will be nice and useful it will give the railway a slight purpose it's nice if the tourist attraction is a touristy and also useful. And uh, that's, that's got to be a good thing. And this bridge crosses over the main line. Uh, Wrexham and Shrewsbury. Station. And here we are, 
Mike at Bowen Station, the end of the line for the Cambridge. Um, so the direction we're pointing, we'll be going to Chirk, Wrexham and Chester. You can actually see the railway lines down there, just about to see them. And that is the line that we'll get on to go to Gabowin. So not Gabowin, we're at Gabowin. That is the line we'll get on to go to Oslo Street. <laughs> um, and behind me will be Shrewsbury up this direction and you can actually see if I step over here, try any bit. There the line goes off to the right. That will be Oslo Street, not Gabowin. There we go. So we'll be able to if they get their, play the cards right, match it up with the mainline trains, the stop at the Orthopaedic Hospital into Oslo Street, I think that'd be fantastic. The thing with West Felton is there's not a lot there. There's not a mass need to go to West Felton. There's, to say, there's very little there. Uh, I think that's why the trains are slightly empty. It's just a tourist thing at the moment. But, uh, you know, Gaboin is a bigger place. If they can get the trains to Gaboin, they will be sorted. We'll be seeing much fuller trains with any luck. Right, thank you very much for watching, taking the time to listen to me waffle on. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you all out there soon. Toodaloo! Mind the gap.